The texting law has gone into effect. Uh, texting while driving is officially illegal. The last half of the year in 2010, they were issuing warnings. Now you can get a ticket if you're texting while driving. So I'd like to bring to you an interesting conversation that I had with Trooper Warner. Uh, he's a state trooper with the Kansas Highway Patrol. Now effective January 1st, uh, we've been able to issue tickets. The fine would be $60 here in Sedgwick County. It would uh, have court costs assigned to it of $95.50 as well. Just to see how the number of text messages sent every minute has increased over the last five years, it's just phenomenal. Have you seen a lot of accidents due to that in the last, say, five years? There, there has been an increase. Uh, one of the studies that is quoted quite often was a study that came out of the Virginia Tech Transportation Institute. They were able to show that if we use the cell phone in, as text messaging, then it puts us at about a 23% greater chance of being involved in a crash or near crash event. At 70 miles per hour, we're traveling 108 feet per second. Three or four seconds of a distraction you've traveled the length of a football field or more. Now there could be some critical information that you miss in that amount of time. I'm so geared towards using every moment to its maximum when driving is not truly downtime. It's probably, for any of us, the most dangerous thing that we do on a daily basis. Where can uh, the average consumer get information and, and read these rules on this law? You know, go to their favorite search engine and look up texting while driving. There's just tons of information out there to help them make a better decision, yeah. more educated, aware uh, decision of whether they want to engage in that behavior while they're driving.